The Scranton Times Tribune is a morning newspaper serving the Scranton, Pennsylvania, U.S. area. It is owned by the Lynette and Haggerty families and their company, Times Shamrock Communications. On Sundays, the paper is published as the Sunday Times. The paper has an average circulation of 47,663. Topic: <laughs> Political leanings. The Scranton Times Tribune editorial policy is generally viewed as independent but progressive. The Times Tribune endorsed George W. Bush in 2000, but did not endorse anyone in 2004. The Times Tribune endorsed Barack Obama in both 2008 and 2012. Topic: History. The current paper is the result of a 2005 merger between the Afternoon Scranton Times and Morning Scranton Tribune. The Times was founded in 1870. It struggled under six owners before E. J. Lynette bought the paper in 1895. Within 20 years, The Times was the dominant newspaper in northeastern Pennsylvania, and the third largest in the state behind only the Philadelphia Inquirer and the Pittsburgh Press. In 1923, Lynette bought one of Scranton's first radio stations, WQAN, thus making The Times the first newspaper in the country to own a radio station. The Lynette family still owns the station today under the calls WEJL. Lynette died in 1943, and his three children took control of the paper with William R. Lynette, the oldest, as publisher. He died in 1946. Siblings Edward J. and Elizabeth R. Lynette took over as co publishers, with Edward J. as editor. Edward J. Lynette died in 1966, and his four children took over, they still run the paper today. Shortly after they took over, The Times expanded to a full week with the appearance of The Sunday Times. In 1990, The Times bought the remains of its principal rival, the Morning Scrantonian Tribune. This paper had been founded in 1891 as the Scranton Tribune. In 1910, it merged with Scranton's first newspaper, The Morning Republican, and changed its name to The Scranton Republican. It became The Scranton Tribune once again in 1936. In 1938, Richard Little, owner of Scranton Sunday Paper, The Scrantonian founded 1897, teamed up with M. L. Goodman to buy the Tribune as well. The Goodman-Little family partnership continued for almost half a century, until Richard Little III sold his interest to the Goodmans in 1986. Only a year later, Media One Corporation no relation to the cable company bought out the Goodmans and merged the two papers into one seven-day morning paper, the Scrantonian Tribune. However, Media One was unable to turn the paper around. In 1990, it shuttered the paper. The Lynettes bought the Scrantonian Tribune nameplate and some other assets, and relaunched the paper as the Scranton Tribune, with much of the same content as The Times except for timely editing. By 2004, it was obvious that Scranton could no longer support a morning and afternoon paper, and the Lynettes announced that their two papers would merge into one morning paper, The Times Tribune. The new paper first rolled off the presses on July 27, 2005. However, its legal name is still the Scranton Times. The licensee for sister radio station WEJL and its satellites is the Scranton Times LP. The paper has appeared a number of times in the office. Topic: <laughs> Awards. The Scranton Times won the Pulitzer Prize for Public Service in 1946, while the Scranton Tribune and Scrantonian then separately owned won the prize for local reporting in 1959. 